everyday life, everyday experiences and take it and turn it into a song. Whether it's a sad experience, you're going to make it seem fun and, you know, bring it to life with your words. You're just that creative. Thank you so much. They say at work, you sing everything. You just <laughs> sing everything. And I just, I, I sing it. I say, give me some chicken. I sing chicken. <laughs> you know, they like, boy, you sing everything. <laughs> now, you know, the first time that I actually saw you, uh, first of all, the, the dapperness is what caught me because you were dressed from head to toe to the nine, I'm telling you, sparkly, bling, bling. And then when you got up there on the floor, when I tell you, you, you got on the floor, I'm not talking about just oh, down yeah. on your knees. You got on the floor. You laid on the floor and still singing. I'm like, okay, that's talent right yeah. there. <laughs> that is great talent. <laughs> yeah, I believe in giving my all. I, I've, I've always been like that. I feel like people, you wanna, people want to feel you. Mm -hmm. and, they, and, 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 and my thing, I want to feel the people. So, I mean, I, I vibe off of the people. And to make somebody smile, a uh, 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 woman smile, you know, and, and, and I mean, that just do something for me, you know, to, to be able to sing to her. And she like, oh, he just singing to me, honey. Mm. He just singing to me. So <laughs> that's, what, that's what I just aim to just please, you know. Uh, 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 the thing about, about that show that we did, uh, my uh, uh, road manager, he was over there. And, uh, and he know he can tell when I'm getting ready to go. Mm. When I'm when I'm I just leave. It's an hour body experience. He can tell. So he come. He he looked over there and saw that woman sitting over there in that jersey. I think it was. Yeah, jersey. And he pointed to it right here, right here, right here, right here. <laughs> so that's the one I went over there saying to. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Uh, so let's talk about. Uh, we we briefly spoke on it. Uh, the pandemic, this quarantine, and everything that's going uh, on. So you didn't let that get you down. You actually wrote a song about that. I did. I did. I, I feel that you got to keep moving, regardless of whatever, you know. And it's depressing if you're allowed to be, you know, uh, to look at everything that's going on with the pandemic and with all the shooting and killing and all that kind of stuff. But you got to keep going. You can't stop because after a while, all of that will pass away. But, and when they pass away, you got to be uh, 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 on your game. You got to be on your game. You got to be willing uh, uh, uh put it in the work so when it's lit up then we can go mm -hmm. you know mm -hmm. definitely definitely Okay, so um, what I want to get into right now real quickly because I know I've taken up enough of your time and I want to thank you so much for uh, talking with me on today because, you know, it's lucky for me and, you know, great for the entire listening audience that we can actually get a few moments of your time with everything that's going on. So once again, I say thank you for that once again. So um, with all of the songs that you have done, uh, I briefly spoke, you know, before we actually went live about a song called um, Long Time. Now, there's a video to this song. It's a slow song. It's a love song. But I told you it's like... It even looks fun. It looks like it's just a fun yeah. song, but it's a love song. And you made the video come alive. And you told me, which I find very shocking, you met the uh, the the person in the video that played your the female lead in the video that very same day. Mm -hmm. And it looked like you guys I have did. known each other for years. No, I'm telling you, I met her the same day. I walked into the place, to the club we were shooting at. And I laid my eyes on her. I said, listen, listen, babe. I'm just going to tell you right now. Me and you got to fall in love. <laughs> you got to like me. I got to like you. And the way you look, oh, I like you. <laughs> 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 and the video turned out awesome. Hey, so for everybody that's listening right now, uh, Marky, can you tell them um, where they can find your music uh, or how they can get in contact with you or anything of that nature? Uh, Want to be booking is on Facebook, but uh, it's on all dig digital outlets. You're on uh, Spotify, you're on Distro Kids, CD Baby, you're on, uh, it's a lot of, lot of different ones that, that we're on, so just put in my name, and if it all fails, you can always put me in on Yahoo or Bing, the Marquee of Soul, and uh, it'll pop up everything about me, everything. Okay, all right, and if you guys haven't had the opportunity to check out a show with the Marquee of Soul on, well, you are missing something, so whenever he comes to your town or anywhere closely, re uh, remotely close to your location, 
make that drive. Go see him. You are not going to be disappointed. He definitely aims to please. Definitely, I'm telling you. So he's a great performer, great performer. Now, also, uh, I ask you, I said, in my opinion, I think that you have a unique, uh, your own style and sound. Okay, now, mm -hmm. is have you been compared to anybody? Because I just, in my ear, I couldn't find anybody to compare you to because you just have your own unique sound. So have you, is there a comparison? Yes, what I do is I take that Al Green sound and that Johnny Taylor sound and I put it together and and, and, and it would come up to the Mark Hill so you know, that, that, that's what I do. Oh, wow. Okay. So there you have it. <laughs> he's his own yeah. individual, but he still has that touch, that sound of, uh, you know, uh, is it, could you say Al is one of your idols? He is. He is. He is. Uh, he taught me the game. I watched him uh, being out there on the road with him. I watched his uh, technique, how he had discipline on, on the stage, you know, and in and off the stage, and his professionalism, how he, he didn't go out and party, you know, he would be in the hotel room to the stage, hotel room back out of town, you know, I, I watched that, and I, I love that mm -hmm. about him, you know, he was great professional, everything was big time, I'm talking about bus, limousine, uh, five-star hotels. I mean, it was just, everything was beautiful. I mean, I enjoyed it. Mm, okay, wow. Well, once again, I want to say thank you for taking time out of your busy schedule to uh, speak with us on today. It's been fun, I'm telling you. Now, I got to ask this question. What is your absolutely all-time favorite song to perform no matter where you go? My favorite song to perform now is Long Time. Yeah. When I I started in the game, and I still, to this day, do some of my Al Green songs. I do uh, Simply Beautiful was my stick when I first started in the business. Mm -hmm. I would sing Simply Beautiful. But uh, now, I, as I sing Long Time, I, I mean, I just feel that song. And uh, with, with one thing I don't think you knew, that on uh, December the 29th, I lost children. Uh, you know, I, I, I saw that on social media. You lost uh, your children, uh, and I'm sorry for that loss. And I'm pretty sure that's yeah. a hard thing to try to get over, but um, you're maintaining. Um, so how is that for you? Oh, uh, it's all right. You know, God, with God help, you know, everything is all right. You know, I, I just trust him, you know, and believe that he had something better for them. He, he, I mean, so I, I put that all in his hands, mm -hmm. and I just move on. I move on, keep going on, because they going to be with him. I still got to live. Right. You know, so I have to keep put, putting one foot before the other and keep pushing, praying. I think some, I, I have my mom at the time, you know, but, I mean, that's normal. Right. I just keep on going, keep on going. Well, and with that being uh -huh. said, um, with the loss of, um, you know, your children, that's a hard thing to get over with, having somebody so close to you um, to uh, yeah. perish. Uh, with uh, Lamone Powers passing away, I know you said you're, uh, you were affiliated with him as well, passing yeah. away on yesterday. Uh, 2020 has not been kind to us at all. No, it's been rough. I mean, it's been rough. We come into it with this pandemic, and then, then the riots and all the killing. Oh, man, it's been rough. It's been rough. But with your mentality, with your character, um, despite the heartache and the hardships that you have gone through, uh, people like you make continuation in 2020 a lot more easier. So I say thank you for that. Oh, you're welcome. You're welcome. You're welcome. All right. So uh, the last few seconds of this video, Marquee, the Marquee of Soul, I want you to let the entire listening audience to know whatever it is that you want them to know about your music, um, about yourself or anything that you want them to know. What is it? Hey, y'all, I'm the Marquee of Soul and I'm ready to party. <laughs> Anytime you have a party, I'm ready to come turn that thing. I do cartwheels, too. Y'all didn't know that, did you? Uh -oh. But anyway, <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. But I went wrong on that floor and kicked my legs in there. Because I believe in giving it all, leaving it right there for the people. You know, I love people. I love to entertain I love to dress up. I mean, I just love it. I love the whole entertainment thing. I love it. And so uh, I want to come to a city, a state near you, and, and come and just, just throw down with 
want you to eat some fried chicken, because I like chicken. You know, I like me some chicken. You, you cook me some chicken, and, 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 and everything will be all right. <laughs> chicken makes the world go round, right? Fried chicken makes yeah. the world go round. Yeah. yeah. I told you guys this interview was going to be fun. I'm telling you, I love his style. I love his character. Uh, thank you so much. And, of course, uh, the new album you said uh, is called what now? It's called Party on the Weekend. It's going to have that giving that thing up. It's going to have a long time. It's going to have uh, a lot of cheetahs. It's going to have... Uh, I'm collaborating with a couple of artists. Uh, 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 Adrena Johnson, I, I think that's her name. And yeah. uh, 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 what is his name? I can't call his name. Rosh, Rosh, what is his name? Rashad the Blues uh, Kid? Rashad, that's him. Rashad. I'm, okay. I'm, I'm, Collaborate with him, and I'm gonna get another artist to collaborate or collaborate with. And, and my big thanks out to Wanda B. You know, she's been my rock. You know, she's been everything to me. You know, she helped me. I can't do anything without her. She helped me along the way. You know, everywhere I go, she goes. She take care of business for me. Big shout out to her, and, and my ex and my whole crew. You know, because uh, I have uh, a guy named Unrated there for me and down for me. I'm just grateful for people to be in my life that helped me along the way. Yeah. Well, good shout out. Good shout out. And real quickly, hey, Marky, if I sat down in your car right now and I was listening to your playlist, who would I be hearing right now? You ain't gonna hear the Marky. Okay. Song, baby. <laughs> That's what I'm you talking about. Long time. <laughs> <laughs> hey, thank you once again for hanging out with me on today, all right? Oh, yeah, yeah, you're welcome, you're welcome. So, uh, I'm not sure what the number is uh, right now, but uh, we need to get some numbers to where the people can contact. Well, they can reach Wanda on Facebook or so. Yeah, I'll definitely we, put that the, information out. All the numbers are usually, usually on all the other information. You know, if you pull it up on Yahoo thing, it can put, you can get in touch with me one way or all. <laughs> All right, and I'm definitely going to put that information out because if you guys want the marquee of soul to come to your location, hey, hit me up and I'm going to give you all of that contact information, all right? Meanwhile, what I need you to do for me, the marquee of soul, is hold the line for me, all right? Okay. All right, and you guys definitely hang tight, stick and stay. Keep it locked right here where you have it. Inside of the box, lunch, hanging out with me, Lady B.